welcome back today i'm going to share with you how to make a simple chocolate cake with whipped cream frosting this is one of the simplest cake to make and you don't need a beater for this to start with preheat your oven at 180 degrees celsius for 10 minutes here i'm greasing a 10 by 7 inch rectangular cake pan with butter and placed a parchment paper on top again greasing with butter on the bottom and the sides as well take a large mixing bowl and add the dry ingredients 1 and 3 4 cup of plain flour 3 4 cup cocoa powder 1 and 1/2 teaspoons of baking soda 1 and 1/2 teaspoons of baking powder and 1/2 teaspoons of salt sift the salt together sifting the dry ingredients is a very important step to get rid of lumps especially cocoa powder tends to have more lumps to this i'm going to add 1 and 3 4 cup of granulated white sugar to it now mix the dry ingredients very well with the help of a whisk mix this until everything is well combined once it's done keep this aside and i'm going to mix the wet ingredients 1 and 1/2 teaspoons of vanilla essence 2 eggs 1 cup coffee at room temperature half cup of oil you can use any flavorless oil and 1 cup of milk take another mixing bowl and add the wet ingredients to it gently mix them all together just until combined and pour them into the dry ingredients mix this very well till you get a very smooth batter the batter will be kind of a runny texture but don't worry that's how it is supposed to be so the thin and smooth cake batter is ready now i'm going to pour this into the prepared cake pan tap this a few times to get rid of the air bubbles and bake it in the preheated oven at 180 degrees celsius for 20 to 25 minutes or until a toothpick inserted into the center comes out clean so the cake is ready and the toothpick inserted in the center is clean now take it out from the oven and allow it to cool down and once it's cooled down we'll remove it from the pan and we'll start the frosting so the cake is cooled and removed from the pan i'm going to cut the cake into two layers with the help of a knife here i have taken a cake board and placed the top layer of the cake as a first layer for the frosting now to make the whipped cream i have used mac top cream here I have taken 2 cups of chilled cream into a bowl. I have also chilled the bowl in the freezer for 10 minutes. To that add 1 teaspoon of vanilla essence. Now start beating at low speed. Once you reach a soft peaks, beat on high speed till you get stiff peaks. So that's ready. Now for the sugar syrup I have taken 3 tablespoons of sugar into a bowl with half cup of water mix this very well till the sugar is dissolved Now brush the prepared sugar syrup generously on top of the cake If you want you can remove the cracked part on top of the cake but I'm keeping as such and that's why I have placed this as a first layer of the cake Now take 1/3 of the cream and spread it evenly on the cake i have used a butter knife for this so the first layer is ready now place the second layer on top of the cake and repeat the process spread the cream evenly all over the cake to give a crumb coat now 
once the crumb coat is done i'm going to keep this in the fridge for at least 30 minutes after 30 minutes take it out from the fridge and spread the remaining cream since i'm using a butter knife i won't get the perfection of using an icing spatula but i'm going to cover the imperfections with the decoration so that's done again keep it in the fridge while making the chocolate frosting here i have taken 3 tablespoons of cocoa powder to a bowl and add hot water little at a time to make the consistency of a melted chocolate like this take 1 cup of chilled cream into a bowl now i'm going to beat them on low speed once it reaches the soft peaks add the prepared cocoa mixture to it now beat on high speed to get stiff peaks so the cream is whipped to stiff peaks and now i'm going to fill the cream into a piping bag with star nozzle and start decorating the cake i have made a rose flower design using the russian nozzle and placed it in the center of the cake instead of discarding the cake crumbs which i got while cutting the cake into layers i'm using them here for decoration so the simple chocolate cake with the whipped cream frosting is ready do try this at home and let me know how it turned out if you like the recipe please give a thumbs up and share your thoughts in the comment section If you are new here please click the subscribe button and tap the bell icon so that you will be notified when i upload new videos thank you for watching see you with another video until then take care bye bye